of the convent we are exploring today is called, in Portuguese, Convento da Nossa Senhora do Castelo, das Covas de Monfurado. In the beginning of the 17th century, a group of monks start to build a convent, primarily to have a secluded place to live and to pray. The convent that we see today was only finished in 1738. With the earthquake of 1755, the convent suffered a lot of damage, but it was reconstructed over time. This place functioned until the 1980s, where it was abandoned for good. With no plans of reconstruction, repair, or a reapproach, this convent lays here abandoned, overgrown and decaying over time. Okay guys, so today, as you saw in the intro, we are exploring a convent. I already been here, but last time that I was here, I totally forgot how big this place is, so I'm back. I'm now currently walking towards the, the convent. It's in the middle of nowhere. And I think this is private property, but... I need to see that convent, and the convent it's belongs to the, the government, so I think it's okay. I already can see a wall, and I know this convent started as a little convent, and then it grew, got bigger, so I don't know. Yeah, it's fully overgrown, but it's there. Now imagine monks living in here. It's so crazy. It's so crazy to think like they picked such secluded places to pray to God and just give their entire lives to, to that. The sun is on the wrong side. Sorry about that. But this is the main entrance to the big church. And I'm gonna try to show you everything. This is worse than the last time. I'm gonna try to show you everything of this convent, but this is gigantic and some parts I cannot show. But take a look. This place is in complete ruins. It's so sad, but it's been here for a long, long time. Wow. Just crazy. Okay, this is weird. I'm gonna say this, but this is just my hunch, my hinge, my, I don't know. I feel like there's tunnels. This feels very hollow, you know? You know when you step... Yeah. You know you, when you step in something and you feel like you're above a bridge or something? This is what it feels like. It's very strange. I'm gonna try to find a passageways because monks are known for having secret tunnels. I'm gonna try to find it, but I don't know. And I'm gonna be really careful, don't worry guys. 
this place is in complete ruins. I know I have to be safe and do things slowly. I'll go one step at a time. And if I see that I cannot go or there's too many bushes or plants, I will not go. But I really want to record this. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm already here. So I'm gonna show you this church first. I can see on that thing, they put a scent on it and there's wood around it. There, there's, there's still wood in this place. I thought it was all gone, but apparently there's still wood. This is another, it, a small altar. And inside of this used to be a dead person, like a monk or something. And this was just an altar for that person. And the same on that side, but it's completely destroyed. So I don't know if he had or not. And yeah, these little holes are for scents, like big imageries. And this is the altar. Back in the days, they didn't have a lot of wood in this area. So what they did was they built the convent and they drew all what they want. All the walls have drawings of just paintings, imagery. Some of them are just normal drawings. Others are imagery. Others are to mimic wallpaper. This one right here, let me show you up close. It's to mimic like a pillar. I don't know if you can see that, but it's to mimic a pillar. And yeah, I think all the wall, especially in this altar, was painted. I don't think the walls of the, the actual space, the big space, I think they didn't have it, but this one has it. And I'm gonna go up there through these stairs. Hopefully there's no spiders or anything. I'm just gonna look down. This is too dark. I don't see shit. Okay, I'm here. Wow. This is pure artistic design. Back in the days, imagine back in the days, the monks painting this. Like, look at that ceiling. Truly, truly beautiful. And it's almost intact, like, Almost everything is intact, which is amazing. And this is the view from up here. Just love it. I don't know if you guys can see that in the video, but the roof or the, the ceiling is made with like a bunch of brick, just whatever, you know? That's why it fell. It's, it wasn't well structured and all the ceiling is now on the floor. But yeah, it, this, is, this place makes me sad. And to be honest, uh, this place makes me sad because like this place belongs to the government, I think. And they are not planning on doing anything with it. I, it's in the middle of nowhere. No one cares about this. I. I completely understand why they don't want to make anything of this, but at least they should like, I don't know. It's hard to say like, oh, come here and preserve this place if you're not gonna use it and if, if it's just like to be destroyed. But this is, this has a lot of history like you, you saw. So it's, I don't know, it's like, it's just here, you know? I don't, I don't know. And another thing, but this is just a side. I feel like not, I'm not alone in, on here. I don't know, it's just a weird vibe because I don't know if it's because everything is dark and closed and makes a lot of echo, but I feel like I'm not alone. I don't know, it's weird. I'm, I, I'm skeptic, I don't know. You guys know, it's just me talking. I don't know, it's, it's whatever. Okay, I will go this way afterwards, but first I just want to check out this place. Yeah, the darker place I want to check out first, yeah. I have my light. I kind of remember this place 
being just an exit point. You see, I don't know why they have so many holes in here. Okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. It was just a small altar, as you see. Some candles and... Obviously, that was put by people, but creepy as shit. But this altar is in perfect condition. Just look at it. Everything, even the cross down here, the little details up there are just crazy. The color, the color is still here. Oh my God. I almost fell in the hole. This is a plaque of someone died and they put this here. I think that's just a room, right? Yeah, there's nothing to see in there. But yeah, okay, let's go to the other side. Ooh, a lot of wind coming this way. What is this? Nothing, just a hole. Oh my God, this is so destroyed. Wow, this nature, crazy. Look at the pillars. Oh, look at look at the wall completely covered by vines. Wow. Okay, I think there's a pit somewhere in here. Okay, there's another room in here. Okay, let me check this room first. Oh, oh, okay. I think these were just rooms. They are empty, right? Yeah. I don't know what these little, what these little rooms are. But do you guys think the monks put themselves in here? I don't think so. I think this was for other things. Oh, this is the exit. Okay, I'm gonna come here at the end. But yeah, I think this is the tower or the kitchen. Yeah, it's the kitchen. This is the chimney. So this was a small kitchen. Okay. This is all destroyed. Oh my God, this is, <sighs> this is endless. But yeah, as you, as I was telling you, this is the Klaustr. I don't know the name in English. I don't know to pronounce. Oh yes, I knew it. There was a pit. My God, this is so green. This is the green that I'm seeing. This is literally green, green, green. I love this. This is such a natural color. I'm literally not editing, color grading this video because this is literally natural color. Wow. And on this side, it's a little bit more destroyed, the arches, but they are still here. The structure of the arches, you see that those things, it's what supports the weight because they are not just straight. They, I can explain better with this arch. You see how they put the brick? It's not like straight like this ones, it's lopsided. So all the weight of the wall uh, falls on here and this supports all the weight of the, the, the wall, the, the wall. That's why the arches are still here and the roof is not. Yeah, the earthquake did massive uh, destruction on this place, as you can see. This is completely destroyed. I don't know where I'm going. I just want, don't want to lose, lose myself in this place. This is just another empty room. Close it off. That's what, oh, this is for the animals. I think there's bats inside of here. But yeah, this was just for animals. Stairs, okay, I'm gonna go up. Oh, this is the kitchen, yeah. This is the big kitchen. Wow, I remember this. You see this big pillar in the middle? It's, it's supported all 
the ceiling but it's now collapsed and this right here used to be the chimney for the the cooking the fires wow i really love this type of architecture it's destroyed but you see those things everywhere on this convent even on the corridors as you can see even on the corridors you have that thing i think it's com it comes to an end in here but i'm gonna check it still it comes to an end and this is the outside <laughs> i think i cannot get out from here it's really completely overgrown but yeah I'm gonna turn off my light so you have so you see what I'm seeing because this looks like oh it's cool it's cool like this is pitch dark I don't see anything <laughs> that's why I'm saying that this convent has a little bit of creepy vibes but for the most part this convent is cool I think this was rooms what is this another big space don't know what for but i think this was a room of someone doesn't have a roof anymore before i go upstairs i want to check everything downstairs and yeah i think that's the way i'm gonna exit so i'm gonna look that way because i forgot to see something that way so Okay, so actually there's nothing more to see down here, so I'm gonna go up. Hopefully these stairs are good. I don't think last time I came here through these stairs, so I don't know. There's holes everywhere, literally. I hope this part of the convent is not falling down because I don't want to fall. You see, why would you build this? I have so many questions like, is this a room? Look, I don't even think I can fit through the door. Yeah, this was definitely a room. This is like a bed. And that's the only window. God. What monks did? I just found it crazy. Like this is another one. No, this is a hallway. To be honest, I don't like this too much because I don't know if this is safe or not. But I'm just going. You guys are with me. And it takes us back to another room or something. The outside. Oh, this is the bathrooms. This was the bathrooms. Okay. To be honest, it feels safe walking around on this convent. But at the same time, I don't trust anything that i do for example this this is the kitchen that i was down there and this is the hallway and that's destroyed so i'm just gonna go slowly through here see where this is going god oh my god this is, this was the rooms of the monks. You see a bed. This, uh, this had like a fireplace. Yeah, some of them don't have beds. Some of them have them. This one is like completely falling down. And this is another hallway. Oh my God. This is literally another hallway. Okay, I'm gonna 
finish this one. Oh, I remember, this is the tower. I don't know if I can go all the way up to the tower, but I'm gonna try. I don't trust this a bit, but I'm here. And this is the tower. This is the tower clock. Let me see if I can show you the view. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This view is incredible. Look at this side. Wow. Oh my God, this is the ceiling that fell. The, the church. Wow. This is really, really cool. Wow. Okay. Just a little bit more of this side. Sorry for the wind and now I'm gonna get down. Okay, I'm back. And I don't have my light on, just to show you how dark this hallway is. It's, it's dark. All the rooms have the sun coming in, except this corridor, so... Yeah, I'm gonna check with the light now. I'm gonna check what this is and just an empty room. Okay, I think this was benches right here. Oh, another stairs. Oh, this goes to the side of the, the church. Okay, okay. So I might go that way. In the end, oh, I know what this is going. I remember, sorry. I need to talk a little bit a little lower because this makes a lot of echo. Skylight. A little room, just another view. This is literally in the middle of nowhere. Like, I love bird sounds and this is just peaceful. So now I kind of get it why they came here. But at the same time, this is too secluded for anyone. I'm literally in the window of the church. <laughs> Just to point out another thing, you see those two chimneys? Those are kitchens and it's in a place that I cannot go because it's all overgrown but yeah this place keeps going down and I came through that path and to show you the final of this video because I think I showed you everything, I think. This is the church. really really cool love this it's it's completely destroyed but I kind of like it and if this hole right here was closed this would be very very dark but this is kind of cool this is kind of cool I like it like it a lot
guys, I'm gonna end my video here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this content and this video. Before I say goodbye, I wanna give a big thank you to my patrons because I don't know if you noticed, but I have a new lens and I can show way better more things because this lens is wider. So I wanna give a big thank you to my patrons. And with all being said, give it a big thumbs up Comment down below your thoughts, opinions, and love. And if you are watching this and you're not subscribed, go down there and subscribe. And this little Portuguese guy says bye. Guys, I think I don't have enough bloopers. <laughs> That's my, my worry. My wo worry. My, my, my concern. Oh my God. There you go, bloopers. As I told you, I came here to see the other castle, but I'm here again and... Every corridor, every room, oh my god, I'm, I... <laughs> oh, fuck. Damn it. I'm gonna fall for sure. I'm gonna fall on this place. Damn it. I have to be careful and I'm just squeezing through everything. Okay, I was not recording, but I already fell. I knew it. Damn it. You remember when I said I didn't have enough bloopers? I already fell three times. I don't know what's happening. And uh, just another thing, I told you that I was feeling someone and something. Uh, I kind of, th that feeling kind of disappeared. I don't know. So yeah, I need to go. I'm gonna fall again. I'm. I know it. Are you? Oh. <laughs> okay. Bye. That are my fault. Fall. Fell.